Hi everyone, it's Philip at NYC Music Services, and I know that there's been a lot of talk about StackPad in the past day or so, so I figured let's write a bar in it and see how it goes. And not just any bar, but a bar from the Rite of Spring, because that's what you do when you try out a new notation app, is you write a very difficult piece of music in it. So let's get started. Quick, clean strokes are just fine. You notice that the ledger lines don't have to be equidistant. Not exactly the greatest penmanship here, but should be fine. Just connect those, get that. And I've got my first bar in staff pad and all the notes look right. If for some reason they weren't, I could just tap and hold and drag them up and down. I'll put a staccato on each of those. Now that's interesting, it thought that that was a note instead of a staccato, so I'll just use the eraser, tap, whoops, got away from it for a second, come back, there we go. So now let's put in some slurs and the triplets and we've got our first bar of music in staff pad. Now tap and hold to put in some text and we'll go to the second bar of music. And you see again you know relatively quick clean quick strokes as best I can. And we'll connect the stems and the beams, just like that. And we've got my second bar of music. Now here's a case again where I have a wrong note, so just drag that up and looks like that should be a B. Sorry, Stravinsky. And let's put in this next bar here, just to have a natural eighth rest. Staff pad likes to draw a quarter rest as an S, so we'll oblige and do it that way. Oh, also a C. Staccato, staccato, a couple of slurs, a couple of triplets, and we've got two bars of music. Let's hear how that sounds so far. Nice. Oh, it should balance that, so we'll put our fortissimo. Great. Let's just skip a bit and go to the violas, because I want to show you tremolos, because those are really cool. So we'll just put in our notes here. I've got my notes. Now, I'm gonna tap up here to bring up some symbols. And I can select from a whole bunch of symbols here. We won't go over that in detail, but just tap the tremolo. And all I need to do is just paint the tremolos across. I just think that's so cool. If I don't like it, just paint back, right? And I can get up to three tremolo lines. I just need one here, because that's all Stravinsky wrote. And that's a little bit of an overview on using StaffPad to write some music. Thanks for watching.